What up you awesome people, I'm Julian coming through with a new music video review for you. This time we got Big 30, FaceTime with my mama, a song that was dropped three days ago and has over 248,000 views. Just before we dive into it and go into the review, a link to the music video is down below. But please help support this channel to grow by whamming that like button and bamming that subscribe button. Thank you. Let's dive right in. So off the rip, I, I gotta say, I already dig the title, you know, FaceTime and my mama. I think we all gotta FaceTime our mamas more often. And you know what? I'm definitely gonna give my mama a call after this video just to be like, hi mama. I'm not really trying to FaceTime you, but I just want you to know I love you. But anyways, enough about that. Let's dive right in. So uh, I don't hate it. I just don't feel it's my cup of tea. I will say the song has some very interesting moments, and I would say I definitely am interested to hear more of what Big 30 does, you know, but I don't, I will say like, even though it's all English, a lot of it I didn't quite fully comprehend or understand. It could just be his accent or it could be his flow. It's all cool. Also, I will tell you that, you know, I do have an auditory processing issue, so that also makes it a little bit slower to process auditory things like people talking. Anyways, enough about my problems. I will say, you know, very interesting. Again, the concept of FaceTime and your mom, I, I really like, especially, you know, depending on where you're from, whether you're in a safe area or not safe area, you never know how long you're going to live and how long she's going to live. So I definitely get that. The song is definitely very violent in terms of the lyrics, but I don't quite feel like it's necessarily promoting violence. It's more saying, you know, Big 30 is basically saying beware of violence, but I could totally be misunderstanding that part. And I do appreciate, you know, warning people about violence, but... We all need to love each other and avoid the violence. Also, I will say one part that's really bothering me, but maybe I just misunderstood it. So, he has a lot of kids. You see them in the music video, understandable. You know, that's fine. I didn't mean understandable. I meant to be like, that's fine. If you have a lot of kids and you can take care of them, great. But he said his daughter at four was twerking. I'm like, that is uncomfortable. That is appalling. That is where, like, not to step in on somebody else parenting, but it's like, that's not good. That's not good. Maybe, again, I misunderstood what you were saying, that you won't let her twerk, but I'm like, why the four-year-old twerking? Why is anyone under the legal age, like, under 18, really twerking? Like, hey, I don't need to get controversial. But I will say, not my cup of tea. Definitely thought it was cool, though, interesting. Now, what I did like is the very end of the music video, it switches to the black and white, like, for, like, 20 seconds, 15 seconds, and the whole beat changes, his flow changes, and I'm not quite sure if that's, like, the next music video he does, but that I dug. If that's part of this song, cool, but it's, like, that type of, like, rhythmic flow I really liked, and, again, this is why I'm down to hear more Big 30 music, especially seeing the diversity that he has. It's just this one particular song is not what I'm going to be suggesting or requesting, but the music video was engaging, and that's what I got to say. What's your opinion today? Let me know in the comments below, and what's your favorite Big 30 song? I would like to know. Until the next one, cheers, players. Forget the maters.